There's still 200 of them left. Looks like all of them are down there. Let's see if anyone popped in here. Nope. Oh, come on, let me get in on some action. God damn. And I say spears don't work, right? They do if there's three of them and they're keeping you at range. It works really, really well. Alright, even the bows. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to have it. Supposed to. What? Okay, that might need some work. I'm not sure if it's on my end or is it the game? Or is it the mods, I should say? Do a couple more battles. That should be it for this series. Next one is going to be Harald. Well, I'm not sure if we're going to need the guy Harald Hardrada, but it's going to be a Varangian god playthrough of sorts. Now, we're not going to be leading a kingdom, though. We're going to join a kingdom. Or basically just follow around one of the emperors and be their bodyguard. Well, follow them around the map. I'm, uh, I, I don't think you can actually, like, follow them around on the battlefield. That would be too... Yeah, if they're on a horse, yeah, there would be no way to do that, actually. Or easy way to do it, at least. Right, I didn't chop the head off of this guy. And that's their leader. How convenient. <laughs> well, the leader, leader of the rebellion at least. Hey dude. Now, uh, it's gonna be interesting if it's, if it's actually possible to like change these, so, like it's uh, you know, you string them up on a cross or something like that. If you're Roman, I don't know what the cities did. What do you want, stranger? Who are you? Stranger. Say. Oh, look who it is, one of our guys. Uh, we're not gonna pick up any of those. I'm at capacity. Let's see. How dare they rebel? And we have so many bonuses, we like have plus two or three. To, uh, loyalty and it's still rebelled. Oh god. Now we're never gonna execute anyone anymore. Look at that. That's gonna go on for fucking ever. Where are the armies? Showing to 
Oh, right. And that's another problem with rebellions. Now, all of these guys are gonna go all the way over there to besiege them. Now, let's uh, pick these guys up. I think we're gonna need more if we're all gonna be alone on this side. The desert. Okay, they don't have that much garrison. Parlay already. They have 13 days of food. What's the problem? Although we, there's like 10 times more men. Oh, God damn it. 10 times more men coming at them. Shock, no. Ranged weapon accuracy. Apparently, we lost a guy who's giving us a ranged weapon damage buff. Like we have a hill we can abuse. Well, let's get our cab on this side. Skirmishers behind them. Like an enemy army has like what two, two three standard bearers. How many do we have? One, two, <laughs> shitload. Everybody gotta pick it up. A little bit. Not sure what I'm gonna do with this archers. We get them on the flank. And this is all their army. Yes, yeah, turn around. See what happens. Yeah, something like this. Get the archers on the flank so they have something to shoot to or at. We have a Sturgeon line breaker. Ah! 
Easy. Have we lost? We lost eight guys in total. Nice. Yeah, lost souls for them indeed. How much garrison do we have there? 71. Which means this guy alone is going to go besiege it. Come on, I dare you. Never mind. Yeah, did you get the assassin cape? This is a mod item. This is a, a Roman helmet. You did cloak or Gallic J, apparently. That's the full name of it. They're too fast. There's a ton of uh, items you can get here. Uh, special items for Romans. Looking mighty. Yeah, we're looking good. Maybe we should do it like this, right? Who needs armor? Okay. Maybe this time we can besiege this. without anybody interrupting me. Probably not, though. Nope. One fucking rebel settlement pulled away three armies. No, two armies. Of course. Where the fuck are you going? Uh, that castle should be... Where the fuck is it? Oh, now they're going from all the way over there to there. How can you make a diplomatic relation with other kingdoms? Well, I think if, we, if you're going to use a diplomacy mod and maybe get an alliance or something, you need to be the king right off the bat somehow. So use a mod, which... Uh, there is a mod that let, lets you start off as a king or a faction leader. Then somehow schmooze another faction leader. Then you can form an alliance. Let's see with the Scythians. This faction is not. Yeah, I, I haven't. They have an alliance with the uh, the OG Carthaginians, which I can't. We can't really tell how long it is. Or is that which, what you mean? But like usually getting a rela- Ooh. Yes. Who the hell is that? Ah, it's one of our guys. Okay. Try number- Declaring war on the Carthaginians. Sure. You only have one settlement left anyway. And look at that. That, that, that automatically declared war on the- um, of G Citians as well. Who the fuck is besieging them? Daisha. Well, it kind of works out for us. Try number three. Besieged, uh, Ortega Castle. Uh, who cares? We're ending the series here anyway. Got that. Fifty-eight to fifty to forty-two in the votes. Why so indecisive? That's uh, you know, a old war and uh, 
Banlord or Mountain Blade in general, nobody out. Uh, I didn't really do anything else. Stalkers out of the blue. Come on, get up again. And if you start your own, like if you start your own kingdom, you're always gonna be at war with almost every single other faction. Maybe, except maybe the one that's on the opposite side of the map. Like you, you never in Mountain Blade could you actually just get out and like you know, form your own kingdom or anything and be it good, have good relations with the other ones. Really. Well, I think I'm stuck a little bit. Just a little bit. What the fuck? Uh, that's a nice way to fall through and get stuck. I guess we're gonna enjoy the action then. If you can actually tell who's who here, I can't. What is happening to you? I fell through some planks. Well, I fell through here. Now I'm kind of stuck. Well, who cares? Not like I'm 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 needed here or anything. Ooh, look at that false go. Maybe I should pick one up, see how much damage that it does in swinging. stuck in a wall or in the sand yeah. okay oh wait 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 oh fuck of course, there's an enemy stuck as well. Just sent the troops in. Well, I think on the, those bugs and all that, I'm gonna end this series here. Playlist will be up if you want to watch this from the beginning. But we have a certain dominance. In terms of manpower, we overpower all of the factions. And we can feed like three or four armies even. Five. And we're twice as strong. We can beat Daisha and Batania at once. Or Gaul. Together we can face them and all that. So guys, thank you for watching. Have a good morning, good day, good night. And see you next time. So for Banlord, next week I'm gonna do the well hopefully next week. I'm gonna do the uh Varangian God playthrough of sorts. And besides that, tomorrow I'll probably stream Warhammer 3. Gorok versus the well we basically dealt with Lizardmen. Or the Novelism and the uh, Skaven. 
should be dealing with Marcus Wolf Wolfheart and uh, the pirates next, I believe. So anyways, guys, see ya.